Hello everybody, I am in Harlem, I am in zip code 10030, you know where that is? That's Harlem baby, I am here at the Drew Hamilton Project, this is where everything started in the 1960s where a lot of families moved in from the south and different places and this is where they they low, they kind of set their set and just kind of stayed here and built families and made friendship. But listen, I just got here. I'm excited because I'm not too far from Sugar Hill. You know Sugar Hill? That's 145th going up the hill. This is the train, close to the A train. Well, anyway, this is relatively close. But I just want to tell you that this is an amazing event. I just got here, and I think Pete Rock is going to be here. I think I saw him. The TUQs are, are coming also. They're here. And my favorite DJ, DJ B. Fats. Listen, anywhere he is, I want to be because he's an amazing DJ. And not only that, he's funny as hell. So listen, don't take my word for it. I heard that uh, Tyrone, Tyrone Williams also is going to be here. And let me just tell you, I heard he moved into this, this, this location here in Drew in 1965. Can you imagine? In this area, you know this area? You know the movie Paid in Full? What year did that come out in? Do you know? Well, go to my page, Believe in Yourself video, and tell me what year that came out in. Somebody said it came out in 19... I don't know. I want you to tell me. But this is where I am. There's a lot of history here in this area. But again, don't take my word for it. I just got here. I think they're cooking fish. They're doing all kinds of stuff. I need to get me a piece of fish and something to drink because there's a lot to cover. I'm excited to be here. I'm excited to share with my people. Stay close. Let's just talk to a few people that can tell me all about this beautiful neighborhood and what it was like when they first got here. Stay connected. Stay close. I'll be back after this commercial break. Peace. Yes, 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 we're up here at the G Bar on Monday, 6.30, come on out, where you see me perform, and a whole lot of other guys perform up here at the G Bar. We're having the ball up here, it's going to be a packed house tonight, y'all need to come on out here, I'm telling you, if y'all want to see some raw talent and some, and some professional talent, come up here to the G Bar on Monday at 6.30 on the Grand Concourse. I'm telling you we have a ball. Also, $15 lobster dinner. You cannot beat that. We are out here. For all the promoters and all of the DJs and everybody that's out there, I'm telling you, this is the place to be on a Monday evening with my man Drew, my man Louie, and my man Warren, and my man Stur. Right here at the G-Bar on Monday, the 6 30. Okay, how you doing? My name is KW Karen Whittle. I'm a manager of the Young Millennials, and um, I just want you to know that they are a group of up-and-coming teenagers within the Bronx community. Um, they do rap songs, but it's clean. But they're very talented. We do all of this through Seaball through uh, Sleep Johnson and Sunshine Whittle. So I just want you to know that when you hear Young Millennial Seaball, you'll know that that's me. And if you need them, you can contact them through the production manager. If you want to get in touch with them, they'll be performing in August. And they're coming to a park near you, okay, because we perform in various parks. The next show is August the 17th. But I'm here tonight, though, just celebrating my friend's birthday, Anisha's birthday. 
and I'm doing karaoke tonight. So just having a little fun. Sometimes as managers, we have to have a little fun sometimes. And that's what I'm doing right now. So stay tuned and God bless. So I want to thank everyone for coming out tonight at the G-Ball located on Grand Concord, 150th Street. You can find me on Facebook. Also, be on the lookout for my new debut album called Tyrone Williams High Times. My single is called I Want You, a uh, Marvin Gaye release. Be on the lookout. Peace, love, and happiness. And believe in yourself. <laughs> Hey, what's going on? It's your boy P Rock. I'm here at Drew Day. You know what I'm saying? I came out, show my man B Fat, to them some love out here. You know, I just got off. And I'm about to go hit the next joint tonight. That's the all white party. My man Frank joint. Hope to see y'all there. Tonight it goes down. Me, B Fat, Hollywood, Smooth Ski, Will Tracks. I'll see y'all tonight. And you can find me on Facebook. Instagram, DJ P Rock. I come right up with the shave on. It's John. Oh, you said John John. John John. Okay. One. Let's try John John. John 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 Let's get Jackie. Jackie Jackie for wacky. You should say for wacky. Jackie. Hold on, we need one more. Wait. Where's your cup that's back? Let's do Cornet! Cornet, Cornet, Bo Bonnet, Banana, Lana, Bo Fonnet, Feet, Fire, Bo Bonnet, Cornet! Anybody else? Oh, shoot, Mel Do, wait. Mel Do? Oh, let's do Mel Do! Mel Do, Mel Do, Bo Bonnet, Banana, Lana, Bo Fell Do, Feet, Fire, Bo Mel Do! Mel Do! I'm not messing with no pools. <laughs> you got some people getting ready to go to jail for throwing water. <laughs> I, ain't mad. I love the police. At 59, I love the police. I don't care what none of y'all say. When I was a youngster, I used to be doing the things I should be doing. That's the only time you should have a problem with the police. But once you get an AARP card in your pocket, And your sciatica start acting up? Absolutely. And you finally paid for a car that you had a five-year uh, loan on? You want the police hanging around your block. That's Trust right. me when I tell you. That's right. Okay. Oh, yeah. I ain't messing with no. I love you, police. All right. So where we going? We going to move on a little bit more? <laughs>
Old Timers Day Reunion. Old Timers Day Reunion. That's right, that's right, that's it's right. Come on out. People. Everybody is out here. Everybody and anybody that knows all about this reunion is out here for old timers. So come out. That's right. Come on out. Come on out. Okay. Hey, that's that's that, that, that's my daughter right there. That's, that's my daughter, daughter right there. And hey. the other yeah. come, come to the other side. Stand on the other side. Yeah. Easier. So tell yes. people what you have coming up, Ty. Um my single is coming out in October. It's called um, I Want You, an old Marvin Gaye remix. Um, also, I'm going to be at the Alhambra tonight performing live. Come on out to the Alhambra. Frank the Cameraman uh, party. We're going to be throwing down in there tonight. So come on out, everybody. And who is this beautiful lady? I'm India. I'm his daughter. <laughs> this is my Hi, second India. time being here. This is amazing. <laughs> I love that. Take, give a shout out to your baby. I love your baby. Shout out to my son, <laughs> Tadir. He's nine months. His name is Tadir. He's spoiled. <laughs> <laughs> so on three, let's just say, uh, let's say believe in yourself. Okay. One, two, three. Believe, believe in, in yourself. yourself. <laughs> <laughs> We all the way live at Old Timers 2019. I'm sitting with my main man, Mel Du and... Randy Edwards. And we just here, baby. You know, we come from way back way with back. the 70, 65. 65, like... Way back in 1965. Yeah, when this park used to have basketball courts and it was a turtle right here. Yeah. And it was a thing you lay on right here. What was oh, that? Yeah. that? Remember that? Well, and then well. the little monkey bars. Turtle. And then we had what was over here? Uh, we got the monkey parallel bars over here. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, you know we here just trying to have some fun doing some karaoke right now. We got Fly Ty. He getting ready to come up next. We got my main, 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 my main man, the first Karate Kid from when we used to go to the movies on 145th Street, and we used to come out the Roosevelt just kicking each other and all that. Old, and then Mike kicked us hard one time. Then we wanted to fight. Then we figured out the hard way that Mike can really do karate, right? Yeah, do it. Hit him. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. He used to kick higher, but see, due to sciatica, his kick done came down a little low. I'll punch him in his mouth now. I'll punch him right in his mouth now. Here's my main, my main man, John Jizzy the Jit, John John in the building. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, John is one of them cats that just always been humble got a lot of love for the family so we just here i just want you to stick around it's gonna just gonna start to fill up i'm telling you, you know we're a little older we can't come out as early we gotta take our yeah we gotta take our medication we gotta make sure that our medication registered okay with our bodies and then once we say uh, all right i can go out now so just stick around we'll be right back with more i believe this but this is dj high c from back in the days he had a record out called Wong. I don't know if you know about Wong. His name is Hasi, but now he is Wong. Right? But I'm gonna let him talk you current Wong. I mean Hasi. No, no, no. He don't want okay. all right, he don't want to say nothing because his teeth might fall out in the middle of a sentence. So I just want to introduce y'all to one of the baddest DJs from back in the days, DJ Hasi in the building. Peace. <laughs>
music for two and I used to always sing that song and my mother used to say to me you really need to do something with your voice but I said ma I done got kind of thick they want naked girls singing now and I can't do that but uh, she died wishing that I would promote myself but I'm really really reserved and really really shy and they forced me to sing that's why I sung <laughs> yes definitely Hey mom, you up in heaven, but rest in peace. I'm doing something, it's very low, but I'm doing a little something. I can't go no further than where God takes me. Amen. Amen. <laughs> hey, check out the service and the cooks right now. Huh? Oh, you got your special mic. Yeah, 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 yeah. Janet, 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 how you doing, baby? How you doing, baby? Let me get around here. Let me get around here and talk to you. Janet, Janet, how you doing today, baby? I'm fine. I'm about to serve some food. You want some? Oh, you get ready to serve some food? Yeah. First, let me ask you, how long you been living in Drew Hamilton? 54 years. 54 years? She been living in Drew Hamilton. Ain't that a blessing there? Yes, yes, yes. Pam. Pam, come over here. Talk to me, baby. Talk to me. This is Janet's sister. Tell, just tell everybody how long you been living in Drew Hamilton out here. 52 years, right? 52 years? Woo, we got the old folks out here, don't we? Nah, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. And how you doing, baby? How you doing? I ain't seen you in a long time, I sugar. How you I'm doing? In the house. Tell everybody your name and tell them how long you been living in Drew. I've been. My name is Busy B. I've been in this since 1975. Oh. Long time. That's and still right. Drew. Always going to be Drew. That's Who right. We with? Drew. Hey. hey. Drew family in the house. Let's, come on, come on, come on, come on. Follow me, follow me. Big line, big line, big line, big line. This is the marriage responsible for everything out here today. 
my I, my big brother. How you doing there? How's Mr. Mr. going? Mr. Lonnie Knox, tell everybody how long you've been living in Drew. Since 1965. 1965. The first people on the seventh floor. That's why I come back. Because I'm an old timer now. That's right. That's so right. If I don't do it, ain't nobody else going to do it. So, you know, the young guys ain't going to do it like that. So, us old guys got to come back out here and show respect for the community where there's no gun violence on this day. That's right. Nothing but family out here. That's right. That's it. We moved in Drew Hamilton in 1965. My family was the first family to move on the third floor in 2660. So, we all family out here. That's right. Come on. Let's keep, 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 keep moving around, moving around, moving around, moving around. J-Mo, J-Mo, brother. J-Mo, brother. The cook, the cook, the chef. The chef, tell everybody your name, tell me how long you've been living in Drew, bro. Jamie O, been living in Drew for like 45 years. Woo. Chilling. Long, long time. Look at that. It's living, some, living in two buildings. That's right. <laughs> there's, some, there's, there's some old OGs out here today, boy. There's some old. Oh, tell, tell them what it, what, what it was like when you moved here. It was beautiful. Laundry mat. Um, all the... Elevators went up. All the elevators went up to from two to twenty-one, and then they stopped it. They made two elevators to, uh, for to the twelve, two to twelve, and then the other elevators they made from thirteen to twenty-one. A lot. Oh, a whole lot. Everything. Oh, oh, Everything. oh, oh. The atmosphere. The, oh, the atmosphere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This used to be one of the best communities yeah. in Harlem. Let yeah. me tell you. Yeah. We used to, we used to get parties out here. We used to be out here at three, four in the morning, yeah. partying like you was in a club yeah. out here. We was a big family it back then. No big tone, big tone. Come over here, bro. Come around, tone. Come around, tone. See those, see those cops out there? They wasn't. It wasn't yeah, yeah. like it wasn't. It wasn't about that. You know? Yeah. See all. See all these gates out here? Back in the day, we ain't had these gates. We ain't had these gates out here. We ain't had nothing. This is just, this is all open. This is all open. You can, you can go from one project all the way to the other project without without going through any of these fences out here. That's right. Tell them, tell them. Come here, bro. Come here, bro. Come here, bro. Give it a holler. Tell how long you been hanging around Jew and oh, Ben and Jew here. 50, 30 years. I'm 57 now. I used to be from one block to the next. We all was in each other's houses. If we wasn't in each other's house, we were playing ball. That's right. We were doing a whole bunch of shit. I ain't gonna say it on camera, but we was having a good time. That's right. That's Living right. Living life to the fullest. All right, to that make it to 57 is a beautiful. You thing. ain't lying, bro. Thank you, bro. I appreciate you, bro. I love oh, you, bro. Bless you, man. Come on, Clint. Let's, let's, let's go around. Let's go around here. My man, my man. Oh, yeah. Something you young girls might not understand. No Woo. No Come on, follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Okay. Yeah, I'm putting all these. Drew Hamilton Knights on, on the film right now. Tell everybody in there, tell me how long you've been living in Drew. My name, yes ma'am, not at all. Yes, yes, yes. My name is Vita, it was Thompson, but now it's Wilson. I've been living in Drew since uh, 1976. I no longer live in Drew, I now live in Florida, and I came back to enjoy myself. Thank you. All right, that's a blessing, that's a blessing. Come on, let's keep moving, let's keep moving, Claude. Come on, let's keep moving. Let's go over here and talk to these lovely, lovely ladies over here. Yeah, I'm coming over here to talk to y'all. I'm coming to talk to y'all. I'm going to get right in between y'all. Because we want to tell us your name and tell us how long you've been living in Drew Hamilton. My name is Diana Baker. That's my mother, Christine Austin. And she's been in this building since it opened up. 50 some years. That means you moved in when I moved in in 1965. That's right. Don't even yes, I moved in that building in 1965. Oh, 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 65. Yeah, 1965. That's right. That's when they was built. I moved in that building, but I moved in that building before the sidewalk was in front of that building. So you know I'm old. What building you live in? 2660 is on the back of my shirt. That's right. That's right. That's the best one. That's right. Uh, come on now. Come on now. <laughs> I hear you. I hear you. All right. Oh, we go. We go. We gonna keep this path moving. Watch out, kids. I mean, keep, keep, keep. Watch out, keep. Watch out, keep there. Come on, come on. We go over to my man Gary. Talk to my man Gary a little bit. Gary, tell everybody in there. Tell them how long you been living in Drew, bro. I've been, I've been living in Drew. We moved in. We, I'm an original tenant. I don't live here no more. My mother still lives here. That's all right. Tell them how long. Tell them how long you've been around, though. Well, I can't tell her. That's a secret. Oh, That's come on now. Right you now. know, I know. You know, I That's know. Secret. I would say before the project. <laughs> all, all, all right, bro. All right, bro. All right, we're going to keep it moving. We're going to keep moving. Hey, Cuz, 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 how you doing, baby? You, do, you doing all right? Come on, stand up, baby. This is, this, this is my lovely cousin right here. My birthday is February 26th. 
Harvey oh, February 28th. Oh, so that's how close we are. Okay, that's right. That's right. Keeping it real. That's right. Tell everybody how long you've been living in Drew. I've been in Drew for over 30 years <laughs> and ain't never going to leave it. That's it's right. my first home right here. That's right. That's right. Thank you, baby. Thank you, baby. And how you doing today? You having a good time out here? I'm fine and you. How you hey, doing? Man, tell me what's going on with you today. I'm chilling, having fun, the family, we all family. This is everyday life for us, but this is a special day where we all can get together and unite as one. How you doing? I'm Madeline. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's keep it moving, let's keep it moving, let's keep it moving. Oh, let me get this cord first, though. I'm going to come in here and talk to these ladies over here. How y'all ladies doing today? All right. Can you get your stand? I'm going to do an interview with you, baby. Really? Yeah, come on, stand up. Come on over here. Yeah, tell us your name, John. Tell us, tell us how long you've been living in Drew. Oh, Drew? I've been living in Drew for like 20 plus years. Uh, yeah, tell, tell, tell them your name. Tell them how long you've been here. I'm Bouncy. Bouncy? I, I know who you is. Tell okay. the people want to know who you is. I'm Bouncy. I've been living in 2660 for 20 plus years. That's right. You're from my building. I know. Okay. All yeah, right. I know. Right. That's right. That's right. Old time is here. Old time is out here today. Let me see who else is out here. She's not petite. No, no, no. Let me see who else is out here from 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 Drew. Been right here long. I don't, I don't I don't see nobody else out here right now, but they'll be out here later. Let me go over here and talk to my brother fast. Oh, I see somebody. Follow me. Follow me. Yo, bro. Tell them how long we've been living in Drew, man. Oh uh, man, I know my family moved moved into Drew in '68. '68, '60, '65, man. Nah, no, we 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 moved in this building right here. Oh, y'all moved in this in '68, '2060. That's I right. I was in here before you. My brother here. Michael was a baby, so I know I happen to know that we've been here in the '60s. I would say the '60s. I don't want to pin it and be wrong, but we've been here since the '60s. Yeah, because I moved in my building in 1965, so that's what. When we moved in here, they didn't even have the locks on the door yet. They ain't had the sidewalk in front of the building yet either. We had to put furniture against the door and hope nobody came into the apartment to that's how right came in. Yeah. that's how long we've been right here this is our home right here one big family with a big backyard that's right <laughs> all right bro thank you bro thank you bro <laughs> bro 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 how you doing bro stand up for a minute i'm getting to stand up for a minute tell him your name tell him how long you've been living in here because i was the original tenant here since 1965 when they first opened so i'm the original tenant here of um, Drew Hamilton, 2680, right from this building right here. Me and my brother Phil Kidd, we are original tenants from Drew Hamilton. I came out here to see my old time friends and hang out with them for a little bit. Every year I come out. So I'm blessed to be out here and see my old friends. Is there anything you would like to change if you could change today? Say that again? Is there anything you would like to change? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All the I like to change, I like to change anything. Everything is beautiful. If people's here, I'm glad they're here. I wish some of my friends that passed away were still here. But they passed away and went on with the Lord. But I thank God that I'm still here. But uh, I miss them. But if I change anything, I can bring them back, but I can't. That's God right. Bless. Thank you, bro. Thank you, bro. Thank you, bro. Let me come over here. Mel do, bro. Mel do, bro. Mel do, bro. Come on over here, man. Tell everybody in there, tell them how long you've been living in Drew. Well, I've been living in Drew since 1965. I'm one of the first families that moved in 2698. Yeah. Any other questions? Yeah, hey, hey, come over here, man. Come over here, cousin. Come over here. Come on. Here. This is another OG. This is another Drew Hamilton OG. Tell everybody in there. Tell deuces first. Deuces to the heart, baby. Because <laughs> this is real. This is the real deal, holy film. Tell everybody how long you've been living in Drew, man. I can't tell them that. Why? Because then that's going to tell our age. They already know. I already told them how long well, I've been here. I, I, I don't know what you're He's been about. 19... He, matter of fact, he was in for me probably 1961. <laughs> so, so I'm telling you. I, I ain't going to say nothing, but I, I watched all three of these projects be built. So, so if I was 1965, you know he was somewhere before then. <laughs> <laughs> so, really, this is where it's at. That's right. We all grew up here as kids. Kids, I meant little boogers, real little boogers. That's what we are. And now we grown men. We can tell the other little, little boogers how to grow up. So, this is where it's at. Thank you, cuz. Thank you, cuz. Deuces to the heart. That's right. Real that's right. OG. That's right. That's right. All right.
This is another OG from Drew Hamilton. Tell them your name and tell them how long you've been you've been All living right. in Drew. Jimmy Bernard, as I moved in here in 65, <laughs> this is the place that made us all men. And we knew we would, if we could make it here, we could make it anywhere. I'm not living in Virginia, but I come up to see this all the time. That's right. Okay. Thank you, bro. I love you, bro, man. You all know right. That. Thank right. you, thank you, thank you. That's it, that's it right now. You see we got a lot of OGs out here. 1965, 1968. That's right, Drew Hamilton. Old Timers Reunion. Peace and love. Believe in yourself. <laughs> My name is Kim. I love you and Mario. I've been coming to Jewel since I was 15 years old. When B Fashionum used to be DJing out here. That's where I first met Tyrone. Jewel is my home. I love Jewel. I'm here every old time of day that I can be. Jewel is my home. Hey everybody, I had the time of my life here at Drew, as they affectionately call it. Met so many great people, there's so many stories. Some people moved in in 1962, some moved in in 1965, but the common denominator is how close everybody were. There were families, although they lived in different buildings, everybody knew each other and everybody loved each other. Isn't it great? It's a home. This is what it is. This is home away from home. Although they've moved away, but they continue to come back for old timers because this is where their heart is. And just like where, how they do, how they come back, when you find something that you love, you have to stick to it. Love the people that you're with. Love the people that support you. Love the people that are meaningful in your life because everything can be gone in a nanosecond. And on that note, I just want to say, I love you, Maya. I love you, Gabriel. These are my kids. You guys hear me talking about them all the time. And I love so many people I've met along the way that are so important to me. Mario Gray, I love you. You're a pain in the butt because that's what you are. But I love you. But continue to follow me, people. Continue to rock with me. And if you have a story that you need told, reach out to me. Reach out to me, Claudette St. Rose. Give me a call. I will come out. Talk to me. Let's discuss prices. I'll come out and do this very same thing for you. Love you to pieces. Look at my page. Reach their testimonials. Reach out to some people who can tell you who I am and what I've done. Love you guys. Continue to watch. Peace and blessings. Stay connected. I'm out. Stop rapping.